After going back and looking at the popular theory of the Fazbear's Fright series being a book series in the universe, it had an interesting thought that instead of Fazbear Entertainment creating the series itself, it could have been a massive storyteller tree. Within the storyteller story, we see that in order to cut costs within the company, Fazbear Entertainment will fire their creator team and instead create the storyteller tree, placing the AI within the center of the pizza plex. The tree's original purpose was to be create new stories for VR, AR, and arcade games by taking templates of previous stories and rearranging them into new ones. We see this the most with the arcade machines and security reach, with most of them being based on games we've seen in the series past, such as Fazbear Noir being a reference to Rockstar Freddy and his behavior in Ultimate Custom Night, Fredbear's Nom Nom Bits being a reference to Fredbear and his bite of 83 minigame in FNAF 4. Mad Science with Dr. Scrapchap being a reference to Scrapchap and after his experiments with seeing Sister Location, and Balloon World being a reference to Balloon Boy and his minigame way back in FNAF 3. We even see arcade games referencing Fazbear's Fright itself within the Pizza Plex, such as Pill Slap Chaser and Catch the Fetch. With the theory on Fazbear's Fright itself, the idea is that the books were created by Fazbear Entertainment, with the company using ideas featured in Legends for their characters in the books, such as the Stitch Racer's penchant for a leaking black liquid being inspired by a shadowy enter leaking molten remnant. The company would then release these books under the same program at birth of Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience, with the books being used to make light of the company's past and turn into nothing more than urban legends and conspiracy. With well, all this in mind, my theory is that after Fazbear Entertainment's creation of the storyteller tree and its installation within the Pizzaplex, the company will use the artificial intelligence to create the Fazbear Fright series, naming it the same name as a horror attraction that attempted to bring Freddy's dark past into the limelight. The book's rather dark stories and often morbid endings will be a result of the corrupted and violent Maybe One program flowing through the storyteller tree. Similar to how more the VR and AR simulations are in the Pizzaplex during Tales from the Pizzaplex. Overall, the books would be successful in making people believe Freddy's history was nothing more than rumors by erratic or eccentric people, as seen by several protagonists of Tales from the Pizzaplex, specifically Luca and his friends in Pressure. 